This image is going viral on the internet. It's a house that has been literally strapped down to anchors on the ground in preparation for Hurricane Milton in Florida. And my modest opinion is, it doesn't work. Here is why. Disclaimer, the following is merely my personal input on the situation. It is not to make fun of such tragedies. Storms can lead to major losses, so always follow official prevention protocols and expert recommendations for hurricane preparation and safety. Hurricanes are ranked on the Sapphire Simpson scale from category 1 to 5. Hurricane Milton, initially a category 3, later weakened to a category 1, but still triggered 38 tornadoes and managed to rip some houses off of the foundation while literally shredding others, and I can't see how these traps would prevent that kind of destruction. When evaluating this trapping method, you have to factor in several things. The overall quality of construction, the age of the house, and whether the windows and doors are reinforced. Florida's building codes were updated after Hurricane Andrew in 1992, making newer homes more resilient to strong storms. This house doesn't look so old and seems to be in good shape, though the lack of visible hurricane shutters or plywood over the windows is really concerning. Exposed windows can easily shatter, allowing wind and rain inside. It's also important to remember that the danger isn't just the wind, it's also the things that the wind is blowing. Trees or seemingly harmless debris can turn into high-speed projectiles by the influence of strong winds. Provided they anchor things correctly, the yellow straps are an interesting and potentially helpful idea for keeping the roof from lifting. But it is still important to know that they are not standard protocol for structural protection. The biggest issue here is that they don't address other major threats, such as flooding or projectile impacts. By the way, the straps aren't exactly a new concept. Some people have tried this in the past and it worked for them, though that doesn't mean you should try it, unless if it's your only choice. Either way, I wish you all the best.